Hello, welcome to CRS Info Solutions. In this session, we are going to cover about permission sets. So permission sets basically deals with the improvising the additional permissions from the existing profile. So for a profile level, if we don't have any access for a specific item, so if you wanted to give access for a specific profile, you can give it. And while giving the permissions, either you can give it for one user or you can give it for multiple users. So let's see a small demo how to use the permission set. Here we go. So now, you know that we have a assistant system admin profile. So you know that we have a assistant system admin profile. So in this profile, we have a contact, right? So for a specific contact, we have removed all the permissions. Now, for time being, I wanted to give only read and create access, but I don't want to change anything in this profile. So in this case, I will be going for the permission sets. So to create a new permission set, you need to search permission sets in the quick find box and select permission sets. Once you select the permission sets, you need to go and select new. So here, I'll just enable the permission sets like contact, read and create. So this is the name of the permission set. So which license it's needed? It's needed Salesforce license. So now the permission set is created. Now, which settings you wanted to change it? Uh, this is the object settings, right? The contact object settings. So in that object settings, for contact, I'll just select edit. So here, tab settings you can make visible and you can enable only read and create access. I'm not giving edit access. So the user can able to see the records on contacts and user can create the records on contacts, but it, the user cannot edit or modify any contacts. So I'll just save this permission set. I'll just go back to the object settings again. So here you just need to notice one thing for accounts. There is no access right now, but in profile level, they have access, even though in the permission set, if they don't have access in profile, if they have access, they can able to access it. So permission set basically deals with to improve the permissions. You cannot degrade the permissions. Okay. So now let's assign the permission set for the specific user. I'll go to manage assignments. So here you can select add assignments. I'll just include this user and permission set has been assigned to this user and you can select done. So one more step is used to assign the permission set. You need to go to the specific users you can select the user and here you can see there is a permission set assignment. You can go to the edit assignments. Here you can either remove or you can either add the permission set. So this is another way to add the permission set. So now the permission set has been assigned to this user. So let's see whether this user can able to create the contacts or not. So I'll just log in it as 
assistant system admin that is a temporary admin user so change this application to sales So here you can see previously the contact option will not be visible to the user. Now temporary system admin can access the contact records. So this user can view all the existing records. But in case if you try to modify this user, so for example, I am opening this user and you won't be having edit option to modify this user but what you can do is you can create new contacts so only you have read and create access so you can able to read and you can able to create it so new contacts waiting for the window so here we go so here you can create one test contact so see here you can able to create it but once you have created the thing is you cannot able to modify this contact see all the fields are read only fields so if you try to modify any fields it won't be there and you won't be having this save cancel or delete you won't be having any options so this is how you can utilize the permission set so thanks for watching this video. Let's see you on another session.